um, like Tone said, um, we're starting to play with more confidence. Um, people come off the bench. Um, Gavin coming hitting some threes. I'm hitting threes. Jerron, Tone. I mean, it's hard to guard five players on the floor that all can, that all can shoot threes. So um, we're just playing with a you know, new swagger. You've been on the other side of this before, Tony. Uh, talk about how you guys diagnosed and attacked that zone defense when there have been other games in your college career where that wasn't the case. Can you compare how well you guys were clicking and what you wanted to do? This year, we have a bunch of knockdown shooters. Um, we have guys with high IQs, guys who can make plays, who can catch the ball on a high post and make a pass down to the baseline. We have guys who can catch the pass down on the baseline. You know, we, um, we have stable guys, guys that, that won't lose their mind out there on the court, stay calm, and get the job done. I felt um, last year, though, we first game we played against Eastern Michigan at third place, it was terrible. It was just awful. Um, we, we, for the second time, we came back, we watched film, and we actually played good here at home against them last year. Um, we found out how to pick that zone apart. <coughs> Tony, at practice, you mentioned that you guys are just getting better and improving each game. Um, can you just imagine you guys pulling down anytime soon? No. <laughs> we, got, we got, I don't know how many guys average in double figures. You know, um, but when, when one doesn't do well, another one will. And another guy coming off the bench will do well. And when that guy's not doing well, he'll still lock in defensively. You know, defense wins games. Tony, we talked recently in practice about you having some pretty big hands in the uh, past couple of games. You've seen you pop the ball, swing one hand back. You know, how, how, is that, how comfortable are you feeling with being able to do that recently? I mean, I used to be a quarterback. You know, um, I used to quarterback throw with one hand. I don't have, yeah, I have huge hands. I guess I'll take advantage of that a little bit. You had a big night tonight. You talk about how uh, can you uh, illustrate how well you guys passed the ball tonight, uh, team-wise? And dive, cut, short corner, high post. Uh, like I said earlier, you know, we, we practiced this in, in practice going against the scout team. The scout team actually did a really good job of, you know, um, trying to play their zone. You know, they actually did a really good job. They had some length up at top just to match their length as well. Um, so we, we, we practiced it. You know, um, we, we picked it apart in practice. Did the same in the game. Jordan, you had back-to-back threes, and then Trey hit a three right after that. What's it like when your team's clicking like that? And everyone was smiling on the bench tonight, because it's just like in Buffalo, too. Yeah, it's something serious out there. <laughs> uh, momentum swing, man, it's, it's, it's real. <laughs> Honestly, like, when we get on a run like that, I mean, it's kind of hard to stop us. Um, we're all flowing, like, we're all hitting shots. I mean, that's, we're kind of hard to beat that way. You're going to have a crazy set of lines tonight. Ian Ryan is the play you guys first start. Uh, how important was Gavin Block tonight? Just when Gavin walked in here first day, we had workouts. You know, um, he's a fresh, of course, he's a freshman. He was passing the ball like crazy. Coach knew that he was a, one of the best, him and Jerron were one, two of the best passers on the team. Gavin came out of show that. You know, um, he could pass the ball, he could shoot the ball, although he didn't make it. 0 for 4 from 3, I think. Um, but uh, when you're not making shots, get others involved, and that's what he did. Anything else? We saw a lot of emotion from about eight minutes, 30 seconds left in the game. You made that layup on the basket, got fouled, and flexed over by the O-Zone. I don't know if we see that emotion from you too often. So what was that like? Those guys kind of kind of drive me up. You know, and they were they were pissed about Gavin catching uh, James Thompson with the elbow, even though it wasn't intentional. You know, so they were out there talking and talking and talking, and it, it, just, it just came to me, man. I was just mad. <laughs> What goes through the other four guys on the court? What are they thinking when you know, Tone has a half like he had in the first half? Keep giving him the ball. I mean, he's just he's out there doing his thing. You know what I'm saying? They can't really stop him. So I mean, just run offense through Tone. You know what I'm saying? He can he can pass the ball. He can score, dribble. He can do all everything. So. I mean, Something you guys actually say during the course of the game? Hey man, they can they can stop him. Right? He says it every game. I say it to him. Every last single game. I say it all the time. <laughs> I say it all the time because I mean. Yeah, you just can't stop them.